I mean, watching the senior classes the last four years do it, um, you know, I, I don't really know. I'm not a guy who you'll see yelling, hooting, and hollering all the time. I'm more of a lead by example guy, but, you know, I, every once in a while, you know, with things that mean a lot to me and who I like, that I care about a lot, I usually get pretty emotional. So I'm going to try not to, but I definitely know it's going to be a, you know, pretty emotional day for me. Watch other guys over the years deal with senior day and then have to go play a game and all that stuff and the emotions that come with it. What have you learned about dealing with it and how do you approach it? Well, just keep your mind focused on the game. Uh, give your parents a hug, whoever's down there, give them a hug, but at the same time, stay focused and get ready to play. Have you ever seen someone get real emotional on senior day and you go, you never knew that was in them? <laughs> no, I haven't. I haven't, like, paid too much attention to it. I'm usually on the sideline, not, not watching it too much, but, I mean, like I said, I don't think anybody get too emotional. You just got to go out there and play football. Pitts thinks he might get choked up. Are you going to get choked up? <laughs> no, I won't get choked up. I won't show that much emotion. <laughs> Obviously, a huge tradition in senior day. Have you thought about what that moment's going to be like? Uh, yeah, a little bit. Uh, I just think, uh, you know, it, it'll definitely be emotional, I think, for, for every single guy because we've been through a ridiculous amount. I mean, uh, everybody likes to look at the games that we, we, we've been in and, in the big time environments that we played in and the wins and the losses. But I think uh, when I run out of the tunnel, it'll be a lot more than that. It'll be all the times that, you know, we've had a tough workout with the guys. You know, you hang out with the guys on, on the all time in football. You're really going to miss that because we'll never, ever get that back. Um, and I think that that's something that this class truly cherishes. And that's why we go out and we play so hard. We play for each other. We play for those memories that we'll, we'll, we'll be able to keep for the rest of our lives. Brendan and Kurt already did it last year. Should they get a chance to do it <laughs> they again? They shouldn't. Uh, I mean, uh, they definitely should. I think um, for all the, all the things that they've done for this program, they, they deserve to run out there 20 times for, for all I care. Uh, but definitely, those are, those are two great guys and two great le leaders on our team. No matter how young or old, you know, you, 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 they definitely deserve it. Yes. You know, the, the BCS climb continues. Is there one thing that motivates you more than anything else going into the Penn State game? Um, there's a lot of motivating factors. Uh, personally, I, don't, I, I just want to play, play well. I think as a team, um, sending the seniors out the right way would probably be the greatest motivating factor for the team as a whole.